Adam harvested 400 pounds of tomatoes yesterday, like in one day. <laughs> um, this is the majority. Well, I guess this is probably about half of them. Half of them are on our porch ready to sell. Um, but he has been up to his ears in harvesting and washing, prepping for sale. Um, so yeah, we hope they sell. <laughs> Just starting to get some corn and it is yummy so Adam picked um, 500 pounds of tomatoes this week maybe and that's all that we have left that I just showed you. Um, so it's time to pick more because we have some big orders to fill. And that's what him and the kids are doing right now. What you doing? Just documenting the hundreds and hundreds of pounds of tomatoes. <laughs> About 2,000 after today. You think so? Total. So how how many do you think you'll do today? Probably You're gonna do them all tonight or in the morning? Start tonight. Yeah. That's what happens when they go too long. Yeah. They sure are pretty when you get them before they're real ripe. Yeah. All the colors. That's a ton. One ton of tomatoes. <laughs> <laughs> so, you picked 500 this week, you think? Or more than that? 575. 575. Wow. Cucumber. That's huge. Wow. Yeah, I don't think people want them that big, though. I only got two big ones. Yeah. Maybe it'll be a little one. Yeah, they like the small ones. And look at all these purple cherry tomatoes. Wow, those are pretty, aren't they? Yeah. I'm going to eat one right now. Here you go. Tiny one. Thank you. Mmm. <laughs> was good. Do you like them? Yeah. So good. And they're so beautiful on the vine. Uh, not yet. Don't get it all the way full. Wait, buddy, sit. Oh, you like the cherry tomatoes, don't you? Yeah, That's um, I'm I'm going to the Cherokee purple. You won't watch me do that. I do. Okay. It's all like two bees. It's like a jungle in here, isn't mm -hmm. it? Look, Mama. Wow. Good job, so, Daddy said after. Y'all harvest tonight and in the morning. Mm -hmm. He's he thinks there'll be like over a thousand pounds that he's harvested so far. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? Look, there's red tomatoes. This is a good time to pick because it's, it's not as hot. Yeah, it is a good time. And I guess he said you're not going to do them all tonight. You'll do them some the rest in the morning. So hopefully getting up early will help with the heat too. But it feels pretty good out here, doesn't it? Yeah, Daddy said um, it was really cool this morning. Yeah, that's good. Maybe it'll be like that tomorrow.
Mama, mm -hmm. it's way easier if you put a, a stick, like right here, uh -huh. it's way lighter. Oh, well that's a good idea, because yours doesn't have a comfy handle. Mine, mine has a good handle, but yours doesn't, and that wire hurts sometimes. So that's why. Mama, look how much I have. Okay. Ready, set. <laughs> good job. Cherry tomato man. Every time I come out here, I feel like I'm part of the great pumpkin Charlie Brown because I, I peek over and I can spy the top of our giant pumpkin we've got growing. I can't wait to show you guys. At first, when I saw this on the vine, I thought it was a um, yellow spot. And here we have the giant pumpkin. Check this vine out. It is amazing. We read that the giant pumpkin vine can grow up to 30 feet. And I would say it's probably about 30 feet now. Look at it, Mama. I know, it's huge, isn't it? Okay. I think it's pretty color too, don't you? Mm hmm So we're gonna let it keep growing, aren't we? Yeah. See how big it can get. It is So back at it again today, huh? Yeah. Daddy had to run. Oh, goodness. So Daddy had to run a big order um, to a neighboring town, a store that had ordered a bunch. So uh, he put us in charge of harvesting more while he was gone. So we're out here again. Dead ones have like red tomatoes on them. Yeah, that's how they do. They start getting, like, they start dying towards the bottom and then see how they keep growing. Yeah, over there. Mm -hmm. So as you can see from what I filmed the other day, uh, walking around the garden with the kids as they were harvesting and, and such, that it is a very busy time. So this is going to be a pretty short uh, little garden tour today. And it's not so much a garden tour, but a garden update and just what we've been up to. And we've been really busy, as are a lot of our friends, as you'll see probably this week also in their videos. Um, this is a garden tour that is in collaboration with Homesteaders of America, and I'm going to leave a link to the playlist um, below for that in the description. So you can check out all of our friends as well, out their gardens and what they've got going on. And I'm sure you'll get some inspiration and uh, maybe some ideas for planning your garden for next year. But we have been incredibly blessed, incredibly busy and incredibly blessed so far this summer to have so many customers coming to our home to buy produce from us. Um, mostly tomatoes <laughs> we've had a few other things we've had squash um we've had zucchini patty pan squash cocozelle squash um cucumbers what else have we had peppers um, yeah that's that's pretty much what we've had going on i've given adam a little break because he has been so incredibly busy working a full-time job and harvesting 
all these tomatoes every other day and then just keeping up with all the other maintenance around the farm milking the cow and moving our meat chickens and making sure everyone's fed and watered every day moving the cows and the sheep so if you have any questions for us if you have any questions that we can answer in the comments or we can answer it next month for our garden tour next month and hopefully Adam will be able to join me at that point uh, if you guessed a few videos ago 600 tomato plants is how many plants that we have in the ground this year and for the most part they are doing really really well we've um had some frost some really late frost we've had torrential rains i mean we've had anything that has you know really tried to destroy our garden and they're still producing really really well so we've been really pleased with that and um I think that about wraps it up so i hope you guys have enjoyed just a little peek at what we've been up to and i hope you'll um, join us next time talk to you later bye <music>